A connected forest sustains us all, and nothing here stands still. Everything moves at its own pace on pathways of its own, on hooves and paws and wings and also wheels. But if you were a woodland creature, and if you needed to move through the lands we share, could you do it? If you had to cross these busy roads and highways to breed, to feed, to respond to the threat of climate change, could you? We have reached a crossroads. We all need a lifeline. Our old ways of seeing and of being no longer serve in the climate crisis. The connections are breaking. We need to do better, to act now together, to protect and reconnect our forests for all our sakes. The Follow the Forest initiative is doing just that. From the Hudson Highlands to Canada, we and our partners are finding and fixing the places between the forests where wildlife and water need to move in your community, with your help and across our region as far as we can imagine, so that this land can still belong to them as we face our future together. Everything in the forest is connected, not by roads and wires, but the web of life, a network we can now see and sustain across these lands we share. Come with us as we follow the forest together. <laughs>